Hey everybody and welcome again to Gear Facts. Today I have the Fender Mustang Mini. It is the small battery powered version of the Mustang series. Let's have a bit of a listen to how it sounds and then we'll talk a bit more about the features and functionality of this amp after this. So that's a quick run through our eight basic amp models, just with a little bit of reverb thrown in on top. Let's go right back to this one, the 59 Bassman, which is a real standout for me, having tried all those models. And also the Supersonic. Both of them are very trebly and chimey which kind of takes advantage of that 5 inch speaker that we have at the bottom here and that's not to say that it can't handle the gutsier lower sorts of sounds as well there are some quite bassy amp models in here such as the British 60s so that's a nice booming sound that feels pretty much like a 12 inch speaker as for effects, we've got the familiar dial system right here. No effect. Bit of chorus. Phaser. A more rapidly oscillating phaser. Tremolo. This will be interesting. This is a pitch shifter that's giving us octave down. Again, the speaker's having no trouble dealing with that kind of frequency. First kind of reverb. Second kind of reverb. Now this is a tap tempo driven delay, and we can change the amount of delay. In fact, we can change the saturation of all the effects by holding down the exit key here 
and turning that effects knob. So there's our somewhat oversaturated delay. Let's try that again. Speed it up a little bit. Very nice. Combination of reverb and chorus. Another tempo driven effect. What's this one? Univibe. That's another nice one. Looking at the top of the amp now we see our eight amp models here and then when the light turns orange you're in a second set of amp models which I haven't shown you yet. Effect style here. The tuning lights here give you a bit of an idea of when you've changed between effects and you'll know exactly what you're on when you start playing. Hold down this exit button and rotate to change the saturation of the effect. Now that I've changed some settings you'll see the save light is illuminated as well so I can save a patch for any of these places here. In other words, set up all the amps exactly the way I like them and save those settings for next time I come back to use the Fender Mustang Mini. USB connection here for your librarian software and to access a bit more detail in your amp settings and effect editing. Phones out, auxiliary in, the usual set of controls at the front of the amp right here. And it's worth noting that down here you can plug in one of these, a Fender foot switch to move through your save patches. I'll play this demo out with a few more of the amp models with the orange light. before I've even started editing those second set of patches. So that's the Fender Mustang Mini, brilliant portable amplifier, and it again holds up the general consensus that Fender Mustang amps are brilliant value for money and extremely versatile. Thanks for watching Gearfacts guys. Once again, check out the Facebook page. Feel free to hit that subscribe button. Feel free to write me a message if you have any questions. Thanks again.